prolific during the lockdown, adding a face mask to his parody of the girl with the pearl earring, for example, or the image of rats running riot in a bathroom. Overnight, he's turned his attention to the NHS. To show his appreciation, he's created a new picture and is showing it at the University Hospital Southampton. Our arts editor, Will Gompertz, has more. Could this be a rare sighting of the elusive street artist Banksy? Undercover, making a special delivery to University Hospital Southampton. Wow. It's certainly his handiwork. It was hung late last night and unveiled this morning. It depicts a young boy kneeling down wearing dungarees and a white T-shirt. A waste paper basket in front of him has two discarded old superheroes. Instead, he's playing with his new model figure, a new superhero, an NHS nurse with a flying cape and arm pointing forwards like Superman. She is on a mission. The idea of the hospital's management and Banksy was to thank the staff of the NHS generally for everything they are doing. So, did it go down well? Just the proudness of it, the, the actual realising that we are thought of and, we're, and respected. Um, for years now, we've, we've not, but now with everything that's going on in this current climate, people are seeing us where we should be with superheroes. Such a nice reward for all the staff that have been working really hard throughout this. Um, we've had members of staff be unwell up themselves and obviously all our patients, and we've all just pulled together and, you know, got on with our work. Why then did the hospital want to work with Banksy? He's really captured the emotion behind the way that the country is recognising the NHS at the moment. Certainly since we've been talking about it this morning, people recognise him, they understand where he's coming from, and uh, they're really appreciative that he's made Southampton the place uh, to recognise the NHS. The plan is for the painting to stay here until after the lockdown at which point it will be sold off at auction with the proceeds going to the NHS, some which will come specifically to this hospital here. It might go for up to a million pounds, maybe even more, if there's a shredder inside. Will Gompertz, BBC News, Southampton.